بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله وحده والصلاة والسلام على من لا نبي بعد Dear respected viewers السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome to another brand new episode of the program entitled Towards the Origin broadcasted live from the studio of Channel S watched on Sky 777 To all of those who will be joining us through our social media platform that is Facebook page and later on through our YouTube channel program or YouTube channel Welcome to the show and inshallah we will be discussing tonight on the topic easy deeds. So we'll find out what does that mean? And in today's context, how can we understand what a deed means? And how easy is it to understand in contemporary context that in terms of earning good deeds, what kind of benefit will it have in this life and perhaps even the life after this? And inshallah, many more we'll be discussing, but after we introduce our tonight's guest, our regular guest, our regular face on the show and on this very program, Fadilat al-Shaykh Qadi Lutu Rahman, Imam and Khatib of London Central Mosque. Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to the show. My pleasure. Thank you very much indeed. Jazakallah khair. Now Jazakallah. let's start our discussion. Easy deeds. Should deeds be easy? Tayyip. <laughs> Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Wa salatu wa salamu ala ashraf al-anbiya'i wal-mursaleen. نبينا محمد بن عبد الله وعلى آله وصحبه الطيبين الطاهرين ومن تبعهم بإحسان إلى يوم الدين ثم ما بعد after praising Allah and sending salam and salutations to the noble prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم I testify that there is none worthy of worship except Allah He is one and he has no partners and I also testify that the noble messenger Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم is the final prophet and slave of Allah Subhanahu wa ta'ala. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, all praise be to Allah. We have entered into uh, another blessed month of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala known as the month of Rajab. And now we are um, nearly halfway through the month of Rajab. Amra Ashri Kubi, Allah Pakra Bul Alamin, Shukura Dekori, Allah Pakra Bul Alamin, Dabra Oshanko, Guni Shukri Gapon Kurti, Jamohan Allah Pakra Bul Alamin, Amadeke Abaro. Allah Pak Rabbul Alamin arakti pobitro mash Rajob mashi amadir ke ashar tofik dan kore chen Alhamdulillah Allah Pak Rabbul Alamin Quran shrif ilik kanayat al muddubalin A'udhu billahi minash shaytan al rajim Inna iddat al shuhuri inda Allahi thna ashar shahran Fi kitab illahi Yawma khalaq al samawati wal arba Minha arbaatun hurum Thalika al dinu al qayyim Fala tazlimu fihin anfusakum Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in this verse that Verily, to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He created 12 months when He created the heavens and the earth. Allah pak rabbul alameen, obashoy, jokon ay ashman ebong jomin ke sishti kore chen, ay priti ke sishti kore chen, tokon tini baroti maasho sishti kore chen. Minha arbaatun hurum, ebong ay baroti maashir madde ho chen, chatti maash ke amra mubarak, ba masjid al ashur al hurum, ba haram ishe amra mune kori, minha arbaatun hurum, Allah pak rabbul alameen bal chen, out of this, these 12 months, there are four sacred and holy months. ذَلِكَ الدِّينُ الْقَيِّمُ That is the straight religion. سِرَاتُ مُسْتَقِيمُ شَهُوَتْ أَبَنْ شَرَوَ الْدَرْمُ شَهُوَتْ أَبَنْ شَرَوَ الْبَوَتْ ذَلِكَ الدِّينُ الْقَيِّمُ فَلَا تَظْلِمُوا فِيهِنَّ أَنفُسَكُمْ And do not oppress anyone. Do not abuse anyone. Do not be unjust to anyone during these months. فَلَا تَظْلِمُوا فِيهِنَّ أَنفُسَكُمْ In general, we understand and we know the prohibition of zulm and abuse and injustice. But in these months, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He considers those actions and those crimes are even more sinful and more dangerous. Amra jadiyo jani je shadanon to zulm nirjaton egulo kintu kharab jinish. Kintu Allah pak rabbul alam, ehi maashkulon madde zulm ebong nirjaton ke aro beshi jagonno, aro beshi kharab ishabe shahi bus to kore chan. And Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, He considers, He says that minha arbaatun hurum, these four months, he said in the hadith that these four months are Rajab, Dhil Qa'da, Dhil Hijjah, and Muharram. So we see according to our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, month of Rajab, it's an important month. It's a month of Haram, a sacred and holy month. And we find our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he used to make a dua in the month of Rajab. Now, when you say the month of Haram, some people may get confused. Is this Haram meaning the prohibited or is there a different meaning to this Haram? So Haram can means prohibited and also it, it means something that's holy and sacred, meaning those months are made uh, 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 sacred and sanctified. 
Okay, so it, in, it has to be applied in context. Yes, in it? context, yes. Okay. So right. like, for example, with the Masjid al-Haram, like Masjid, which is Holy Mosque, the sanctified mosque, uh, uh, Masjid, uh, Masjid al-Haram. So we find there are Haram. Haram can mean prohibition, and it can mean also sanctified and holy. Okay, so one word, but two or two or multiple two, yes, meanings. Yes, exactly. It depends right. on the context then. That's right, yes. Okay, fair yeah. enough. Thank you. So uh, our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam used to also make a dua in the, in the month of Rajab. And during the month of Rajab and Sha'ban, by saying, many of us, we know, Amra Wani Kekin to Idwata Jani, Amad Piyoni Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Rajab ibang Sha'ban ma she dukle pore unyek to dua kortan. She dua chilo, Allahumma barik lana fi Rajab wa Sha'ban wa balighna Ramadan. Or that hell of a crabble alamin, a mother Rajab Ebong Shaban Mashke Borkot Moe, Borkot Punokoro, make month of Rajab and Shaban, blessed, Wabellina Ramadan, and a mother K, Tofik Dan Korjate Koramba, Ramzan Mashpur and the Postivari, give us the life and ability that we can reach the holy month of Ramadan. A doaju de Kyoshik the Chai Kota Pajabe? Uh, of course, you can find in, in, in many uh, Islamic books, the books of du'as, and also in books of hadith of our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. What about Hisn al-Muslim? And, and exactly, yeah. You, can, you may find in, in Hisn al-Muslim, but you may find in, in, in other books of du'as okay. that are available. But we say normally, Allahumma barik lana fi rajab wa shaban wa balighna Ramadan. Hey Allah, amad al-rajab ibang shaban mashke barkat mo kuro, barkat puno kuro, ibang amad ke tawfiq dan kuro jate kuro amra amzan mashpo nito. So we can reach the month of Ramadan. Um, then we find um, there is a scholar, a great scholar of Islam known as Abu Bakr al-Warraq al-Balkhi. He said a beautiful statement about these three months. Because if you think about it, month of Rajab, it's just a preparation. And Sha'ban is a preparation for the greatest month, which is the month of Ramadan, um, coming in about one and a half month time. Um, so uh, Abu Bakr al-Warraq al-Balkhi, he says, Shahru Rajab, Shahru uh, Azara, month of Rajab is like month of cultivation. Or that Rajab Masjid Amra, Bumi Chashkurti. We are cultivating the land. Then he says, Wa Shahru Shaban, Shahru Sakil Zara. And the month of Shaban, we are planting and water, sorry, we are watering the cultivation or the plantation. With Amra Panidichi, Shaban Mashe. And month of Ramadan, it's a month of collecting the vegetations. So we're reaping the fruits and vegetation that we have done during the early two months, month of Rajab and Sha'ban. So generally, uh, these months are a, a preparation for the month of Quran and month of uh, Siyam and Qiyam, which is coming uh, in, in, in a few weeks' time, inshallah. Now, I can have a preparation bulletin. Now, let's look at it from a contemporary perspective. People who are working, professional people, Jarakat, Kutchen, City Teba, whatever they're doing, business or uh, services, whatever they do. Akon Kaze plan Kibabe Korajai that they can at least make sure if they can't take the whole of Ramadan, at least they can get the last 10 nights of Ramadan. Surely that also comes into preparation. Of course, yes. Um, I mean, month of Ramadan is just coming soon and, and it's one month out of 12 months. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is giving us the opportunity and ability, uh, chances to get close to Him. And slowly, slowly we are, we are approaching. Ramadan Mashid is going to go to the end of the day. এই একটি মাস কিন্তু আমাদেরকে দেওয়া হচ্ছে যাতে করে আমরা আল্লাহ পাক রব্বুল আলামিনের সান্নিধ্য লাভ করতে পারি নিকটবর্তী হতে পারি এবং জাস্ট ওয়ে ইউ সেড ইয়েস ইফ নো 30 ডেজ পসিবল বা উই ক্যান মেবি ডেডিকেট 10 ডেজ ওর মেবি হাউ মেনি ডেজ উই ক্যান উই ডেডিকেট টু ওয়াশিপ আল্লাহ সুবহানাহু ওয়া তাআলা ডিউরিং দোজ ডেজ এন্ড দ্যাটস দ্যাটস আ ওয়ান্ডারফুল অপরচুনিটি টু গেট আওয়ার সিনস ফরগিভেন এন্ড টু অ্যাচিভ দ্য ক্লোজনেস এন্ড নিয়ারনেস অফ আল্লাহ তাবারক ওয়া তাআলা would you not say the 10 nights last 10 nights yeah, last, preferable yes, exactly yes last 10 nights are the most maybe some of the most important nights out of the month of ramadan okay ar arekta jinish dakha jay je ramadan ashle amader kintu abar preparation bolte amra buji khabar stock yes. piling up our food stock and many people already maybe start to buy the food yes. and as as the shaban month come we'll see the the queues and the lines in yes. the grocery shop is that what it means preparation uh, i mean uh, many of us we take ramadan as part of culture as well and and there are people who even buy do the eid shopping before before the month of ramadan unfortunately not a big number but yeah, some but, do but some do yeah. yes yes so i mean we have to really look uh, into the original teaching and original uh, 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 um, actions of the month of ramadan and what we should be doing and how we should be spending the month of Ramadan. That should be the actual plan, rather than what we'll be eating and what kind of iftar we'll have and how we'll celebrate our Eid. That shouldn't be the first. Of course, they come with the um, original uh, planning, 
but they're not the main things. Arakta planning er bishoy ashe Quran tilawat kora. Yes. Abong ita ke completion kora at least ekta target thakte hobe na. E target to apni Ramadan ashle to kora jaena. Preparation definitely. Now yes, and planning needs to be planning needs to be done. Done. Taile eilo to Ramadan mash ashara ke to plan kutte hobe. Obosh, obosh. Amra we have to prepare mentally, physically, manushik hobe. Abong amra shadi hobe. Ekon theke na amra preparation nitha hobe. Prosthiti nitha hobe. Jamra ki hobe. Amader eishono gulo karabo. So we will speak about few things that we can do. To utilize these uh, blessed months of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that are coming ahead. And that's the reason why we say what we can do to do the easy deeds. Meaning, like sometimes uh, we think that ibadah may be very difficult, ibadah possibly uh, can be a burden. আমরা কিছু কিছু আমল করতে পারি যে আমলগুলো করলে পরে আমরা কিন্তু আল্লাহ পাক রাব্বুল আলামিনের সান্নিধ্য লাভ করতে পারব ওনার mohabbat এবং ভালোবাসা আমরা লাভ করতে পারব প্রিয় নবী মুহাম্মদ সাল্লাল্লাহু আলাইহি ওয়াসাল্লামের mohabbat এবং ভালোবাসা আমরা লাভ করতে পারব যদি আমরা কিছু আমল করতে পারি এন্ড দ্যাটস দ্য রিজন ওয়াই সেইং ইজি ডিডস সামটাইম ইজি ডিডস ক্যান টেক আস রিয়েলি ফার এন্ড এন্ড দে মে নট বি টু ডিফিকাল্ট নাও এখন মানুষের মনে প্রশ্ন জাগতেই পারে ডিডস যেতে এত ইজি হয় থাকে তাহলে তো এটা রিওয়ার্ডও কম থাকতে পারে কারণ নরমালি ওয়েন ইজ সামথিং ডিফিকাল্ট দ্য রিওয়ার্ড On return is higher. Possible, but then sometimes, and that's the reason why, you know, when, if you have knowledge about something, then you may actually achieve more by doing maybe less. Okay. Quality, sometimes quality matters. What you're doing, how you're doing, quality of the things that you're doing, that can actually take you closer to What about to the long. continuity? And continuation as well, it's mm. very, very important. Uh, we do things continuously, even though it may be less in quantity. Um, so some of the things that we can do to get close to Allah Ta'ala, and they are possibly easy to some, and it could be difficult for some, but still we see it as um, see them as easy deeds. Um, now, before I go to that, I would like to say that some of the scholars of Islam, they uh, categorized Islam into few different categories. There, are, there can be different sort of counting and different categories, but I would like to mention some scholars of Islam, they categorize Islam into five major uh, portions or five major uh, pillars or five major um, sections and categories. Mm -hmm. So number one, we say that when we talk about Islam is aqaid. So what is aqaid? It's the jama' and the plural of aqidah. And aqidah is our belief, faith itself, aqidah. So the things that connect to aqidah, uh, for example, uh, the oneness of Allah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala echo binno. Like the aqidah bishoy, amadir, bishashir bishoy. As you know, ulamai karam ra islam ke paachpa ke bhi wakta kore chen. Onek ulamai karam. Even binno ulamai karam, binno categories diya chen. Kintu shadhanat amra dekhti paari onek shenko ulamai karam onara islam ke paachpa ke bhi wakta kore chen. Number one, onara bol chen aqidah al-aqaid. Jam of aqidah o tat bahu bo chen aqidah bahu bo chen al-aqaid. এটা হচ্ছে আমাদের বিশ্বাস আমাদের বিশ্বাস কীভাবে হবে আল্লাহ পাক সব আরব্বুল আলমী সম্পর্কে প্রিয় নবী মোহাম্মদ সাল্লা আসম সম্পর্কে এটা মানে সাধারণত উই সে আওয়ার ক্রিড অ্যান্ড আওয়ার 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 ইম্যান সো আকিদা ইজ ইজ রিলেটেড টু দ্য ওয়ানেস অফ আল্লাহ দি দ্য ফাইনালিটি অফ প্রফ মোহাম্মদ সাল্লাহ আলী সাল্লাম আমাদের মোহাম্মদ সাল্লা আসলাম উনি হচ্ছেন লাস্ট এবং সর্বশেষ নবী ইস্যুজ ফর এক্সাম্পল ডে অফ জাজমেন্ট Um, the sifat of Allah, the qualities of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, attributes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, these are connected to uh, aqidah. For example, love for Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. There are certain things that are connected to aqidah. Then we find the scholars of Islam, they say, there is another section and that is ibadat. So how is, uh, how is aqidah is different to, how is aqidah different to ibadah? How aqidah, faith is different to ibadah, worship. Or that aqidah kibabay, Upashana yamang ibadat teke binno. So ibadah is, is directly what we do for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, such as prayers, salah. Salah is, is, is directly ibadah. And then we have uh, fasting in the month of Ramadan. And also generally fasting is ibadah, directly worship. Then we have hajj, pilgrimage. A hajj is also again directly ibadah. So there are things that we do and they are known as the direct ibadah, worship of Allah. Dhikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is a direct ibadah. So when we say subhanallah, alhamdulillah, wallahu akbar, these are direct ibadah. So we said number one, al-aqaid, aqidah, then we say ibadah. So the di difference between aqidah, aqidah is connected to our faith and iman and belief. Then ibadah is what we do to obey Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala. 
Then they give another section, another category, and they say al-mu'ashara. So what is mu'ashara? Mu'ashara is uh, something known as public relation, like our connection with people, our relationship with people. Our shamporko kibabe amader pita matar shata hobe. Amader shami abong stri shamporko kibabe hobe. Amader fellow Muslim bhai bunera jara achse ne shamajer mutadish shata amar amader bebar kibabe hobe. O Muslim de shata bebar kibabe hobe. All of these things, public relations, are known as muashara. So how we should be with people in general, known as muashara. Now, if any problem ashe, they we have certain times we have double standard within ourselves. যে আমরা মনে করি মুসলমান হলে এক ধরনের ব্যবহার যারা মুসলমানের মানে ধর্মে বা অন্য ধর্মের যারা অবলম্ব তাদের সাথে ব্যবহার কিন্তু অন্যভাবে এই যে একটা পার্থক্য করি আমরা দ্যাটস নাম্বার ওয়ান ইন আই ওয়ান্ট টু আস্ক ইউ অ্যান্ড সেকেন্ডলি ওয়াই ইজ এ দ্যাট উই ডু দ্যাট ইজ ই ইন আ ইগনোরেন্স ও ইজ ই বিকজ অফ ল্যাক অফ আন্ডারস্ট্যান্ডিং so uh, of course like uh, th there would be some time some sort of difference in 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 conducts because um i mean we should be good with everybody that's that's the general that's teaching. the baseline that's the basis yeah okay. that we should be good with everybody whether um someone's muslim or non muslim there is some human uh, uh, you know the rights as a human being mm. but then also sometime we the, the the behaviors and and conducts can be slightly different based on the faith or background of the person or the belief of the person. So it can differ, but in general, we need to understand that we need to be good with people. What it means to be good, we have to do that. And that's the most important thing. But based on the people we are, uh, uh, we are dealing with, and that's the reason why Prophet ﷺ said, uh, uh, treat people accordingly. Now, it can have a problem when you say the word good. Mm. Now, for an instance, we have, Amadar Muthi to Chinta, Ataja, Ita Kintu Bhalo, but not necessarily Shamadar Junno Ita Bhalo. আবার অনেক সময় আছে আমরা না বুঝে আমরা উইদা ইন আর ইগনোরেন্স উই আর থিংকিং দ্যাট উই ডুইং গুড বাট ইটস কমপ্লিটলি দি অপোজিট অফ ভাইস ভার্সা তাহলে এই যে জিনিসটা বোঝা যে ভালো কোনটা এটার জন্য তো একটু জ্ঞান লাগবে নাকি অবশ্যই অবশ্যই সো দ্যাস দ্য রিজন ওয়াইস ইট ইট ইজ গুড টু রিমেইন উইথিন দ্য টিচিং অফ আল্লাহ এন্ড দ্য মেসেঞ্জার সাল্লাল্লাহু আলাইহি ওয়াসাল্লাম এন্ড দ্য টিচিং অফ কোরআন এন্ড সুন্নাতুর রাসূল সাল্লাল্লাহু আলাইহি ওয়াসাল্লাম and sometimes we there are common goods that we can learn from people as well and there are things that we uh, goodness uh, 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 um, uh, shared by people of all uh, ideologies and all faith so for example being thankful being patient um, you know gratitude thanking somebody uh, being nice to someone smiling these are all uh, good things that everybody loves and and i'm sure all uh, uh, you know good human beings and and sound human beings would definitely um, like and, and, and appreciate. Now, when you say good with people, now we divide into two contexts. Mm -hmm. For example, when they return back to the country of origin, when acting like um you know uh, you know people who are over there or maybe like the both the uh, whole country are maybe or the tamra jish bolte jacche je we can our land kora pore dekha jay we local culture to dikhe amra chole jai so uh, normally we have to understand that we represent ourselves we don't represent other people but i know sometimes it can be difficult because when the culture amader amader jonno onek shomoy khori na jete pare jokhon amra ekta culture er modhe dhuke pori tokhon আপনি যখন অনেকে বলতে বলতে পারেন এই কথাটা যে আপনি যখন এক ভালো হয়ে যাবেন when you are good by yourself then everybody start taking advantage or that আপনি যখন একটা কিউর মধ্যে আপনি কাড়া আছেন এমন একটা দেশে বনা করেন আপনি বাংলাদেশে আমাদের যে থার্ড ওয়ার্ল্ড যেগুলো আমরা বলে থাকি আপনি কি মধ্যে কাড়া আছেন কিন্তু আপনার আগে আপনার সামনে হয়তো 10 জন 15 জন চলে আসবে some people will come and jump into those queues or I mean queue with the duke over there okay that i understand exception but generally but, but then, see. yes but then we still should try our best to have these good traits good practice that we have learned not from from others but from our own sort of teaching from our own 
and source and source of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, source of Islam in general. So we should we should not just go with the flow. And that's that's a problem. People generally go with the flow. For example, that's that's another problem, yes. And, 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 and this is the reason why we see like people who are under our sort of authority and under our uh, uh, you know our training people don't listen to us and people don't take our words <laughs> because a lot of time because we don't do it and when we don't do obviously people who are around us they will not they, will, they can tell and that's the reason why sometimes you don't have to say if you practice something regularly mm -hmm. if you do something like on a on a on a daily basis apni jodi ekta jinish ke sob shomoy shorboda apnar apni kore thaken tokhon apnar pashoborti jara lok ache apnar niche jara ache ora kintu automatically shike felbe sometimes we don't have to speak but sometimes actions speak can mm -hmm. speak louder than, than, than even telling. So um, certainly we have to really do what we say and what we preach according to our level best. I know it's not always easy, but we should still try our best to do what we say and what we preach. Otherwise it becomes a, a double standard and sometimes it can even cons be considered as hypocrisy. Why do you say things that you don't do? And, and one of the things that we normally uh, say, usually say, like it could be that, for example, smoking. A lot of us, we say our younger, our minors should not smoke. And that's true and that's right. But then we are smoking on a daily basis so how would others um, learn and take our advice Correct. if we are doing our by our own selves so um, so we were speaking about aqeedah mu'amala we said mu'amala sorry aqeedah we said we spoke about it faith and iman um, uh, ibadah we said worship which is prayer fasting hajj all those things and then we said al mu'ashara al mu'ashara mu is public relation connecting people how we should be people and then we have got something else called mu'amala that's another category of Islam. What is Mu'amala? Mu'amala is like buying, selling, like Kitab al Dealings. Dealing and transaction, mm -hmm. um, how we should be uh, 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 doing our own businesses, how we should be uh, conducting when it comes to dealing and transaction. Now, if you have a correct point, we'll look at dealing, how should we contact? Now, in our community, we have a question about trust. There is no agreement, no terms and conditions. Just go into the business based on trust. Because um, sometimes over over excessive or that means Sometimes we we say, oh, I'm my brother. So we don't we just trust. But this can lead to uh, a huge problems and 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 disunity in in, in families and um, in society. Thank you very much for that. My dear viewers, we have been listening to our tonight's topic, or we have been discussing easy deeds with Sheikh Qadir Utur Rahman and how he was advising on what we should be doing. And there are certain actions which might be considered to be small, but in the sight of Allah, there you, we never know what the reward will be. Inshallah, we'll continue our discussion after a short break. You're watching Towards the Origin. We'll be right back in a few moments. Thank you very much. Welcome to welcome back to Towards the Origin, broadcast live from the studio of Channel S, watched on Sky 777. Joining me tonight are our regular guest, Sheikh Qadi Lutfur Rahman, um, respected Imam and Khatib, or in fact, one of the Imam and Khatib of Regent's Park, Moscow. Sheikh, we were discussing our topic tonight is easy deeds, and you did mention about certain qualities and certain aspects in the first segment. Now, before we move on to the detail of the second segment, just to recap, when it comes to earning deeds, mm -hmm. there is another problem we have that we have got that kind of approach. Certain people, they, if I do something, it needs to be known. Mm -hmm. For example, I have help financially. I help social challenges marital life, etc. Et mm -hmm. We make sure somehow, if not directly, indirectly, mm -hmm. we support we help mm -hmm. Of course, I have to say this disclaimer, we don't know the intention. Of course, yeah, However, true. externally, a lot of people may put question mark 
after this act. Mm. So uh, this is a problem we normally say it and repeat it. Um, it's, it's, it's an issue uh, related to our, our qalb. And so uh, the scholars of, of spirituality, they say that people have to cleanse their hearts. And, and the way they can cleanse their qalb and, and, and purify their souls is by doing everything for the sake of Allah. And that's the first thing in our religion, intention and niyyah. Al-Ikhlas. And that's the reason why some people, some scholars of Islam, they say the meaning of Al-Islam is Ikhlas Al-Ubudiyya Lillah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. To make everything that we do in this world for Allah Wa Ta'ala. And not to be a known and not to be a uh, famous and not to be told good things. Some of us, we rely only on, on good words. I'm not going to say that the word is not the word. 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 This intention is not the word. The word is not the word. The word is not the word. You know, many of us, when we go to Bangladesh, we expect, and I was surprised to hear that some people apparently onik manush amader moddhe achen je mane connect jaga jawar age uni kintu ei je jeta ke amra reception bole je sammanona program sammanona je sambardhana je program sambardhana je program gulo ache onike kintu unara nijetai nijerai kintu eta ke eta ke organize koren there are people who actually organize by themselves instead of uh, other people organizing now, int interesting you say that ekhon hoye geche contemporary life e ekhon hoye geche eta prachar korar dhoron ta change hoye geche ekhon social media ami ekti kaj korechi I put the pictures that this is what I've done mm. for this orphan, this is what I've done for this yes, poor people, yes, this yes. is what I've done. I mean, if it's now, done, if it's done for, for a good reason, for example, you're encouraging others. But you can to there is a way to do things. Yep, I mean, that's again, people can tell as well. Yes, When you correct. do something for any uh, promotion, for the good thing, for good reason, when you apply to the new authorship, you can do it. 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 You can You can do it. 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 Time, wake up. Or, or it messages. could be they could check in Fajr time in Masjid. Mm -hmm. Alhamdulillah, which is Ajib. good. But it, it's sometimes people question was yeah. it a necessary? Was exactly. that needed? And, and sometimes we do things that they have become very unnecessary. And that's that's probably the downside of the social media. unnecessary. I mean, they might unnecessary activities and just to uh, be uh, be on the safe side kono kono manush hoyto eta ei jonno kore thaken shudhu jodi baireo desh gula je je thaken for example so, um, haramaine to, to, to reassure, to let, reassure to and reassure. let their families know that they have exactly. that's, that's um, a, a, a arrived safely as long as there's a reason and and i said very very clearly that people can tell jara amra jara shruta achen jara apni jara darshok jara achen ora kintu bolte parben je ki kun niyote korchen so we have to be very careful people are not really um, dumb people are not uh, foolish মানুষ <laughs> When you put it in the Malamalu Biniat, actions are judged according to intention. On Shir Amole Shopkichu Darmadar, Nirboko Chapna, Niotripore. So this religion is based upon Nia. And that's the reason why Salah needs Nia, Namazan Niotlage, Apner Ruza Rujarakaragan Niotlage, Apner Hodgkaragan Niotlage. So why Niot in Nia will determine. Your action. I can actually just clarify. Mm -hmm. Is that true? 
that's verbally, that's, that's a masala uh, uh, different by the scholar. Ulama ikram the mother, 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 it is okay to say verbally, as long as you don't think it's parts of Sunnah. Man, it's not a must. But verbally, we have to say that 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 we But are you opinion that says if you have done the intention, then yes, you don't some, have to some say it. Say, some say you don't have to say verbally, and some say you, don't, you shouldn't say it. But there are some who say that you can say and they are mentioned in the books of fiqh. Okay, so there's a difference of opinion that, Exactly, that. that's okay. right. And we should respect one another. Definitely, without any doubt. So, going back to the discussion, we said Islam categorized by a few different categories. Number one, we said aqidah, al ibadah, worship, al muashara, public relation, our, our connection, our relationship with people. And then we said al muamala, dealing and transaction, business, how we should do business. And then another part of al Islam, according to some scholars, is siyasa. And that's how a, a, a country should be run. That's another part of al Islam. What's the translation of siyasa? Siyasa, you can um, say that it could be, um, some say, may say politics, but within politics today, like some say, okay, today's politics is he like same as the politics of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi How he did it, was he exactly the same? So that, that could be a, a matter of discussion and debate. But we say siyasa, it's a knowledge that we learn um, in order to uh, uh, rule an, uh, an administration, or, or in order to uh, manage or administ govern an administration, manage or govern an administration. Mm -hmm. That's called ilm siyasa, and this is also part of an Islam. So, if any of these part is missed, then scholars of Islam they say that we may have some deficiencies in understanding of of deen, because this is all practiced by our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And actually, akhlaq also part of it. But akhlaq we say in muamalat and muasharat. Um, akhlaq falls into mu'amal and mu'ashara now uh, in, in public relation and in, in dealing and transaction that's business. true but the aspect of siyasa that many people don't believe in so again that's that's something that sometimes you see like there is something we need to make clarify i may not be able to do something that's one thing but to believe in those things is the fundamental or i'm to do now kortebari but our uh, possibility, our ability, our uh, taqat, our uh, understanding and limit. But I am here to show you that we are not going to be But our belief has to be correct. Okay. Our belief has to be correct. We may not be able to do like when I go and apne. One day, look at our Jamaat Shete when you put in the Jamaat, that is why we are not going to be able to do it. Because we are not going to be able to do it. Because we are not going to be able to do it. Because we are not going to be able to do it. Because we are not going to be able to do it. Because we are not going to be able to do it. Um, similarly, Islam needs to be understood as a whole. But unfortunately today, a lot of people, many different people give many different explanations and interpretation of Islam. Now, can and people say, oh, according to my understanding, what I think, now, this is what it is. That's true, but you can say that you don't know the translation, you don't know the translation, you don't know the translation. No, again, that's then, then sh that should be with every science. You have to learn your own lawyer. Anybody would accept? You say, I have become a lawyer by reading the books, some of the books of law. Um, I have become a, a doctor by reading some of the books of medicines. Okay. Would anyone accept? No. No one would accept. So um, how about the Sharia of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? So these are some of the categories about Islam, and Islam doesn't complete, according to uh, a number of scholars. Now, going back to the issue of how, what we can do to, we, we will focus on ibadah today, because we normally speak about, for example, we do speak about akhlaq and character. So what can we do to increase uh, and we can get close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by doing some of the ibadah? Let's talk one by one. You mentioned earlier Quran al kareem that we need to make a good plan for Quran. And Quran, you're right, because Quran is the best zikr and it's the best, best, best thing that we have in this world. You mean the recitation? Quran al kareem Yes, in Quran al kareem itself. Because that's the only attribute. At the ekmatra Allah pakra bala alamin al guna boli, jee guna boli ta amader amader kacha se. This is the only attribute that we have um, uh, with within our fingertips, and that's Quran al Karim. Now, Quran needs to be given priority as a Muslim, and many of us we are actually we've abandoned Quran. We've gone really far from Quran. Many of us we don't know how to recite. Many of us we know how to recite, but we leave Quran al Karim on the shelves for years and months and we don't recite. Um, some of us, we know how to recite, but we never even intend or plan to understand. And that's an, an important uh, part of Noble Quran, that we learn how to recite and then we try to understand uh, you know, what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said. But again, 
from the correct sources and with the reliable scholars of Islam. Now, one thing I would like to suggest that let's take things slowly, slowly, gradually, and, and slowly. So one number one I would like to say, I'm Jinish Tabotashi, the Quran Shafi Mode quite a good Tupuna Surachi. A Suragalo Kamri the Poli Tawanik in the Allah Pakra Pulana Min Sharni to Talab Kurtaba. And we can get really close to Allah and they are the rewards are very, very high. Now a Khan Manushita Dharana Hoti Pareja Quran Potikti Surah is important. Hey, all the surahs are important, but uh Kuno Kuna Surah, Unno Surah Take, Allah to Bashi for Why is that? So, for example, Surah to Yasin, Yasin Surah, I'm ready to bullet it. I'm not the one who can alhamdulillah Surah Yasin Mokostacho. Many of us memorize Surah to Yasin. We can recite Surah to Yasin in the morning and in the evening. What are the benefits and rewards of Surah to Yasin? Our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam saying, Man Qara Surah to Yasin, Layla, Man Qara Surah to Yasin, Fi Layla. If anybody recites Surah Yasin in the night, he will wake up forgiven. Or that Jekuno Bekti, Judi Surah Yasin Shari Poren, Ratrabalai, when he came to Shakalbala, would be Nekdom Munar Gunakata Mafaj. Ratrabalai ki Gumanurage? After Isha, in the evening. And then also another hadith suggests to recite in the morning. And if so, if somebody recites in the morning, the days of the, the sins of the day are forgiven as well. So, how long does it take to read Surah Yasin? Maybe 10 minutes. We can spend hours on, on phones and social media and things like that, on YouTubes. But reciting Surah Yasin takes maybe 10, 15 minutes. And imagine we are becoming really uh, 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 forgiven for the night and the day if we're reciting in the morning and in the evening. And just to clarify, when you say forgiven, mm. people might think that I have got big, I've, I may have committed major wrongdoing during yeah. the day or night. Does it mean those will no, also no. be forgiven? No, no. The Kabira, the, the major sins, or the Kabira Guna Jigulate, the if it's connected with the rights of people, then we have to ask forgiveness from okay. people as well. So, um, so it should be understood in context. Exactly. Yeah. But we're talking about sagair in general, the sins will be forgiven. The small, and we should small practice, sins, you mean? Yes, the okay. minor sins, sagair. So we should really practice reciting Surah Yasin in the morning and in the evening. And of course, Prophet Sallallahu said in another okay. hadith, the inna li shay, inna li kulli shay in qalb. Everything has heart. Everything has a qalb. Well, Qalb al-Qur'an Surah Yaseen and the heart of Qur'an Kareem is Surah Yaseen. Mm -hmm. Then we can recite another Surah that many of us know is called Surah Al-Mulk. And Surah Al-Mulk is another important chapter in the Noble Qur'an, 29th chapter of the Noble Qur'an, beginning of the 29th para or 29th juz or 29th part of the Noble Qur'an. So what does Allah subhanahu uh, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said about Surah Al-Mulk? Surah Al-Mulk is also important Surah. Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said about Surah Al-Mulk, again, it doesn't take uh, more than five, six minutes maybe. Prophet Sallam saying, Surah Tabarak hiya al mani'a min adhab al qabr. Surah Tabarak, it actually prevents uh, an individual uh, uh, from the great punishment. Or the Qabur al-Ajab taki, a German rakkawati parve, jodi uni Surah al-Mulk paratakan ratrubalai. If someone recites Surah al-Mulk. Then Prophet Sallam saying also, in the Quran, ayah, thalathun ayah. In Quran al Karim, there are 30 verses. Quran Shumbad, tishti ayah taroche, ekta Surah al Muddi. Shay Surah to the Kopolata can tell what a Kamata did on our journal, or Jiri Telaut Karijano, which Ash or Surah Shafayat Kobe. This Surah will do the intercession for the reciter of Surah Al Mulk, and then Professor I'm saying, O Yetabar, Rufirala, O Yetabar, can levy be at Hil Mulk. If we recite Surah Al Mulk, then we can get also close to Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala, sins will be forgiven, intercession will be given, Shafayat Dohobe, Evan Manshir Ajat the Kobe, Ajat the Kamashke, Rokka Korahobe. So we can recite Quran, and there are many other surahs in the Noble Quran that are very, very important. Like, قُلْ هُوَ اللَّهُ أَحَدْ مُعَوَّذَتَيْنْ قُلْ أَعُوذُ بِرَبِّ الْفَلَقْ قُلْ أَعُوذُ بِرَبِّ النَّاسِ And now, today, in these days uh, that we are going through this, uh, you know, the virus that we're talking yeah, about. Yeah, I'll come to that. I'll yeah. come to that later, inshallah. So uh, we can recite the protection, the, 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 the surahs of protection. And there are, for example, Surah Al-Ikhlas, قُلْ هُوَ اللَّهُ أَحَدْ قُلْ أَعُوذُ بِرَبِّ الْفَلَقْ and Qul A'udhu Bi Nas, also known uh, as very, very important surah. Qul Huwa Allahu Ahad. Actually, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi said that if you recite once, you get reward of one third of Quran al Karim. Now, I can't imagine that I'm going to read it in Arabic, but I'm going to read it in Arabic. But to get, the, to get the full reward, you have to recite in Arabic. And okay. Ibadah doesn't happen without the Arabic language. Okay. And that's the reason why the language of Ibadah in Islam is, 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 the, is the Arabic language. Or that Amade Ibadu Taj Bashro Chama the Dorma Mode, Sita Chari Pasha. About Onik Shum Onik understanding Takakon to Bosh Hagatahon Porajabana Shikajabana. Is that mm. true? 
Yes, so that's again another misunderstanding and misconception within our society that if we are elderly people, we can't learn. That's, that's a huge misunderstanding. People in this country study until very, uh, uh, people study at the age of 60, 70, doing master's, PhD. And people, even I've seen in the Arab world, people are memorizing Quran in very late age. আমাদের মধ্যে অনেকে বলতে গেলে আমার তো বয়স ষাট হয়ে গেছে আমার বয়স সত্তর হয়ে গেছে আমার বয়স পঞ্চাশের উপর আমি কীভাবে পড়ব দিস ইজ এ মিসআন্ডারস্ট্যান্ডিং নলেজ ইজ ফ্রম ক্রেডিট ডেথ মানে অর্থাৎ জন্ম থেকে মৃত্যু পর্যন্ত তারপর এইটাও তো দেখা যায় যদি আমি স্মার্টফোন টেকনোলজি যদি আমি শিখতে পারি তাহলে কেন আমি আরবি পড়া শিখতে পারবো না Exactly, and this is just uh, excuses, and also... Uh, well, with due respect, we're not accusing course. anyone, yes, yes, yes. but sometimes this could be cultural as well. Perhaps, is this culture or not? No, take it, take it, take it. So, uh, we can do uh, some of the easy deeds that actually get us really close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Another thing we can do, the dhikr, which is the lightest thing we can do. And dhikr is something very easy, everyone can do. You can do dhikr while you are walking, while you are driving. আপনি যে কোনো সময় কিন্তু আল্লাহ পাকরা বলে আলমিনের জিকির করতে পারেন এবং জিকির কিন্তু আমাদের অত্যন্ত গুরুত্বপূর্ণ একটি আমল এবং আল্লাহ পাকরা বলে আলমকুরআন সম্মত বলে ইয়া ইহাল্লাদিন আমানুদ কুরুল্লাহ জিকরান কাথিরা হে ইমানদার কোন তোমরা এত জিকির করো যে জিকিরটা যেন আনলিমিটেড হয়ে থাকে অর্থাৎ ডু অ্যাজ মাচ অ্যাজ পসিবল অ্যান্ড ইন অ্যাবান্ডেন্স সো হোয়াট এভার ইন শর্ট whatever we can do within our capacity with the correct intention yes. we should continue however yes. not one off but continue doing yeah, that yeah exactly and i would like to just share one like short hadith the prophet sam said in hadith and that's the last uh, uh, hadith in sahih al bukhari prophet said that kalimatan khafifatan ala lisan there are two words that are very light on the tongue when it could be shaj bolte gele tar prophet said thaqilatan fil mizan they're very heavy and weighty on the scale or that scale mud the মিজানের মধ্যে খুবই কিন্তু ভারী দেন ইজ হাবিবে চান ইলার রহমান দ্য ভেরি বেলাভ টু আল্লাহ সুবহান ও তালা অ্যান্ড দিস টু ওয়াজ আর সুবহান আল্লাহ আলহামদিহি সুবহান আল্লাহ আল আজিম সুবহান আল্লাহ আলহামদি সুবহান আল্লাহ আজিম ভেরি ভেরি ইম্পর্টেন্ট বা শর্ট ওকে নাও কামিং টু দি এন্ড অফ দি প্রোগ্রাম আই জাস্ট ওয়ান্ট টু র্যাপ ইট আপ উই নো এখন আমরা জানি যে করোনা ভাইরাস একটি ইম্পর্টেন্ট অ্যাসপেক্ট অ্যান্ড সাবজেক্ট সবাই কিন্তু কথা বলছে অ্যান্ড আউড লাইক টু অ্যাড্রেস দিস ইস্যু ইন বাংলা এখন যে এই সমস্যা চলছে প্রথমগত তবাক্কর আল আল্লাহ এবং প্রিকশন এটা আমরা কিভাবে ম্যানেজ করব ওকে সো ফার্স্ট অফ অল আমরা যে জিনিস বলতে চাই প্রথম হচ্ছে ইন্না কুল্লা শাইইন খালাকনাহু বি কাদার আল্লাহ সুবহান তাআলা মেড ইট ভেরি ক্লিয়ার দ্যাট এভরিথিং ইজ ক্রিয়েটেড উইথ ডিক্রি এন্ড ফেট এন্ড ডেস্টিনি অর্থাৎ তাকদীরের সাথে সৃষ্টি হয়েছে এবং দিস ইজ আ ঈমান এন্ড মুসলিমস অ্যাকচুয়ালি আর ভেরি डिफरेंट পিপল বিকজ ইন দ্য পার্ট অফ দ্য ফেথ ইট সেজ ওয়াল কাদরি খাইরি ওয়াল কাদরি ওয়াল কাদরি খাইরি ওয়া শাররি Yeah, or that everything that happens, good or bad, is by the will, will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Okay. But, again, Islam is a religion of moderation and balance. Or that it could be a lot of good things. But if we have a lot of good things, 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 we have a lot of good things. And this is the hadith that is clear. When we have a lot of good things, we have a lot of good things, we have a lot of good things, we have a lot of good things. He just left his camel, sorry, at the wood. untied মানে এটাকে না ভেদে উনি মসজিদের ভিতরে ঢুকে পড়ছে তখন রাসূল আকরাম সাল্লাল্লাহু আলাইহি ওয়াসাল্লাম বলেছেন এ আকিল মানে কি এজন্য তুমি কিভাবে আসছো তো উনি বলছে যে আমি তো আল্লাহর উপর তাওয়াক্কুল করছি তখন রাসূল আকরাম সাল্লাল্লাহু আলাইহি ওয়াসাল্লাম বলেছেন গো যাও তুমি এটাকে ভেদে ভেদে আসো ইট গো এন্ড টাইট এন্ড দেন ওয়া তাওয়াক্কাল আলা আল্লাহ তারপর তুমি আল্লাহ পাকের উপর তাওয়াক্কুল করো কিন্তু এটা কিন্তু ব্যালেন্স হতে হবে সাম অফ आवर পিপল উই হ্যাভ গন টু মাচ অন ট্রাস্ট এন্ড আদার্স টু মাচ অন রিলায়িং অন থিংস ম্যাটেরিয়াল থিংস অন ম্যাটেরিয়াল থিংস জি সো अगेन উই হ্যাভ টু রিমেইন ইন দি correct understanding of Islam when it comes to this. Okay, now we're going to talk about mainstream media, we're going to talk about panic and fear. As a Muslim, what is the problem we have? I'm going to talk about this, I'm going to talk about the position of the position, I'm going to talk about this. Everything is happened by the will of Allah. And if, for example, I would say 20, 60 or 50 people are affected, we have 78 million people. জি মানে ইন কনটেক্সটে বুঝতে হবে তাহলে ইয়েস সো ইউ হ্যাভ টু রিয়েলি সি লাইক ইউ নো হাউ মেনি পিপল এন্ড 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 ইভেন লাইক ফর एग्जांपल 100 দেন ইউ সি লাইক 70 মিলিয়ন পিপল সো ইটস 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 স্টিল ভেরি ভেরি লেস এন্ড এন্ড আলহামদুলিল্লাহ ইন দিস কান্ট্রি দ্য সিস্টেম ওয়ার্কিং ভেরি হার্ড এন্ড দ্য गवर्नमेंट এন্ড দ্য এনএইচএস দে আর ওয়ার্কিং রিয়েলি হার্ড টু টু মেক শোর থিংস আর আমাদের করি নিয়ে কি ভেরি ইম্পর্টেন্ট এন্ড ওয়ান অফ দিং আই ওয়ান্ট টু মেনশন লেস 
some of us we keep on forwarding things. Amra kitu mani WhatsApp, social media, je kono jina amra forward kotha. Mani verification chala bolte. Exactly. My humble request would be we should remain amar je ekta mani onudu hotse, onudu thabe. Amar je akul abedon jote hotse, je amra je local authority ba amader je NHS chita hotse, health system ata uter advice shat amra thakbe. Mani ja kitu peethi without verification je amra forward na kori. We should, we must not do that. And also because we are causing problems for people. And we are causing an incredible amount of uh, 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 worry. I mean, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm finally, what's the specific kind of dua? Um, so obviously, we know the dua is which is going around. Allahumma inna na'udhu bika min al-barasi wal-junun wal-judhami wa sayyil asqam. What's that? We can find in the books of dua. We can find in, in many places nowadays. It's, it's mashallah going through everywhere. And uh, in the books of Hadith of Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, dua from the serious, uh, to uh, protect us from the serious illnesses. Allahumma inna na'udhu bika min al-barasi. If we haven't come across the dua, please listen very carefully. Amra utunto manujuk shukar shuna chishta kuri. Allahumma inna na'udhu bika min al-barasi wal-jununi wal-judhami wa sayyil asqam. Very good. And arakti kotha hoche, onik manush hoche, jamaat e shate namaj adai kurti chatche. Aba onik shame hoche je amra ibadat ki kub, mani gurutti diye kurti chatche. Kintu ekhane kintu public health, by public health England tarak kintu clearly bolche jodi kaar jodi kono symptom dakhade, taile irokom gathering theke avoid kora. Taile ei jinish kula ke amader ki jebabe bola hoyche, do we need to make sure je amra correctly kela buji? Um, again, I think uh, we need to really take things uh, uh, properly because uh, we, we again we don't want to be isolated as well. Like uh, even there are people who say like avoid uh, like big gatherings, but they themselves are in, in big congregations. But if there is a case, if there is an instruction yeah, given, exactly. If there is an instruction, we should remain a, a instruction. Shati, I'm with Okay. I mean, thank you ever so much. Inshallah, I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you. Uh, no thank problem. you ever very much once again for giving us your valuable time. Barakallah fikum, it's my pleasure. Welcome. With this, my dear viewers, we have come to the conclusion of our tonight's discussion. Obviously, it needs to be taken and understood in context, especially the coronavirus. Just to summarize, we have to have our full trust in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That's first. And secondly, that also comes in hand with action. Precaution steps need to be panic. Kora door kar nai. Jeba be amader official body jigula ase public health England NHS government jigula body ase. Tara jeba be amader ki advice dichen. Amra sheba be advice jigula ki follow korbo. Abang jodi amra sure na thake, tale jara ibi shoy jane tadeshte amra juga juk korbo. Pasha pashi ami ite bolte chachi jodi kauri jeba be kono dhoron symptom dakhad day. Apnara please make sure korbe n kono hospital le jabe na kono GP te jabe na. Instruction of say clearly one 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 a after a call Corbin among shatter shatter after I go to this discussion Corbin among the baby up of this there are hobby make sure you take those action accordingly do the after a grow recently or you come affected jack attack after the travel court again among it'll come symptom to take it back and please make sure that you do not go out you do not go and attend hospital. You do not go to GP. Call 111 and then take the necessary action. Even public gathering transport up near avoid Corbin. And as Sheikh has mentioned, panic hover ki tsunai, population that can percentage ki apra dikte patini. Kintu, we have to understand things in context. And importantly, Judy Amadir Kumutana Durbolata Thake, make sure that we consult right people, those who have knowledge and those who are in the right department. That's all from us for tonight. Inshallah, until next time, we hope to see you again in our next episode. Subhanakallahumma bihamdik. Nashadu an la ilaha illa ant. Nastaghfiruka wa natubu ilaik. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh.